So do you have any questions before we begin this interview? Well, explaining to me exactly how solar energy works, because I really never have come in, never really something I'd really talked about mm -hmm. or well, known about that much. That is actually going to be a part of the interview process, so we really just want to know what do you know about it, and then later on we can explore further and talk about solar energy. So first, um, let me ask you, what type of home ownership do you have? Are you an owner? Are you a renter? Owner. Owner. And can you describe me the structure of your house just in general? Is a uh, vinyl siding. Mm -hmm. um, outside, we have a closed-in garage okay. and back a, a porch on the back. How many bedrooms? We have three bedrooms, two baths. Um, up and down or one Just floor? one story. One story. Is it a single family detached or is it a duplex? Single family. Okay. And homeowner. So have you always lived in Cook County? Yes. How, how long have you been here? All my life. All your life. So can you tell me how your family ended up in Cook County? Like where are you all originally from? Well, my mom and dad are both from originally from Cook County. Okay, so yes, like a native here, Cook County mm, a native, resident, right? Homegrown. Wow, that's really interesting because I'm from the Philippines and I actually met my husband who lives in Tifton, Georgia. So now we live in Tifton, and I am a renter. Rent it's rent to home, rent to own home, mm -hmm. and it's a brick house, and we live in the country. So, have you ever invested in solar, either on the rooftop of your home, any part of your property, business, any part of a program through your utility, any solar? None. None? Okay. And why did you not adopt rooftop solar in any place of your residence? Never. Well... We have a rooftop that's the that new that new aluminum okay. top. Mm -hmm. We've had it on there probably at least maybe eight, seven, eight years. But I'm not sure if that it's I don't think that's solar. solar. No, yeah. that's not mm -hmm. solar. Well, I know, and so we've never been. If we have been offered, we're well, probably because of the expense mm -hmm. of it. You know. Okay. But. Did you make that decision, not having rooftop solar, or was it made for you? We made the decision. You made the decision. But if it was available, would you? do you think you would want solar? Tell me why you would or you would not want rooftop solar. Now, first of all, the solar, that would be the save, is it the cost? Yes. Cost, cut, mm -hmm. uh, save energy. Save energy, yep. The solar panels. So if it was available to you, do you think you would want it? Depends on how much it would cost us, mm -hmm. you know, versus what we're paying as far as, you know, electricity, electricity bill. bills right mm -hmm. now. We would have to, you know, do the math uh -huh. long term. But oh. we've never had anybody just come by, you know, saying, hey, we're, we're um, offering this. Yeah, offering yes. this deal, you know, mm -hmm. if you get your roof redone, you know, with the whatever, blah, blah, blah. Okay, so, had that so do you right now... Uh, if if it was made available, you would have to look into it first. Yes, like it depends. Yes, yes. All right. How much money it would save us? Okay, so cost and you know how much money it would save. Mm -hmm. So right now I have here a map of the United States of America, and I would like for you to draw where do you think um, people who are high adopters of rooftop solar energy where would they be? So just draw in there the map of the United States, put a star or circle it, mm -hmm. and where do you think people adopt or invest in the most solar? Draw it on the map, and you know just think about it, what kind of people they are, what kind of jobs do they have, where do they live? Hmm. Okay, and then this is... This is us. Yes, mm -hmm. this is us down here. I'm not good at directions. <laughs> <laughs> With me being foreign, I'm the same way. I don't really know <laughs> which is which. 
But if you would I'm just, just gonna you know, say, guess. I'm just going to guess. You say a star. You say yeah, a star or a circle. Okay. Anywhere. Just draw on the map. You think um, up north over there. Okay. Yeah. In more than one place? It, it doesn't matter. Okay. Wherever you think, you, you would okay. go there. And um, who do you think lives there? What kind of people? Why did well, you choose? Northerners. Northerners, mm -hmm. okay. So what makes you think that um, the Northerners, or what makes that community so different from the people here in Cook County? Why you chose them to be the people who would most likely adopt rooftop solar? Well, because of the, the heating, maybe. Mm -hmm. So just the difference in location where they yes. live versus where we're from. Mm -hmm. Maybe that's why. Is that is that what you're trying mm -hmm. to say? All right. What about if you would guess what kind of, you know, jobs or communities, which people, which groups would most likely adopt solar? Would you have, do you have any idea? Well, those in your, I would think, the high-income bracket. All right, yes. high-income bracket. Mm -hmm. And now let's talk about the state of Georgia. So here is a map of the state of Georgia. And I would, act, would like to ask you to do the same thing. Draw on the map where you think people adopt or invest in the, in the most solar. <laughs> Okay, maybe the Columbus. Okay, Columbus area. area. And what makes that community so different from the people where we're from, Cook County? Like, why do you think? What led you to that assumption that you know they're the ones that adopt the most solar? Once again. Mm -hmm. Well, I th maybe I made the wrong choices okay. in the beginning. Maybe <laughs> it would be in the southern part. Okay. You know, mm -hmm. because of the temperatures. Mm -hmm. So I think I made the wrong choice. So now that you kind of like thought through it, if you, yes. if you want to go back to the yes. map of the United States. Now, where do you think most I mean, people... I think in the southern states. Okay, southern states. Yes. Because it gets hotter. Okay. And you want something to conserve the energy, mm -hmm. you know, to help. Because when you're, when you, when, whenever, I don't really know how that stuff works, works. Mm -hmm. but it's supposed to, you know, cut costs. Mm -hmm. And I would think someone in the southern part would benefit from it more. Okay. You know, you want to, so, yeah, circle say, or star, or, okay, in just this southern. Area, yeah. All around in this area, okay. the southern states. The southern states. And then here in Georgia, mm -hmm. would it also be the southern counties, or what do you think? Would I would they say be? the southern counties. Well, would Cook County be in the one of the southern counties? Do you think we belong to that group that would adopt solar energy? Yes or no? Man, we possibly could. Mm-hmm. So, going through that um, statement right there, I want to move on to this question. What about your close friends or family around here in Cook County? Do you know anybody um, that have solar? None. None? Nobody. Why do you think they don't? Just not interested mm -hmm. or um, and the cost. Okay. Interested and the cost.